Finally on 13 News Now, a little girl from Moyoc facing a frightening ordeal. She has an inoperable brain tumor, her future uncertain. But she isn't alone. Megan Parrier has the story. Savannah Kretzer thought she had a stomach bug. The family dog, Chloe, stayed by her side. Nine month old golden retriever that just would not get off of her. Back and forth from the couch to the bathroom, back to the couch. But things got worse, and Jacqueline Kretzer took her daughter, Savannah, to CHKD. It came to rule, to rule out anything more dangerous than what we thought it could be. And it didn't go as we planned. They stayed for 10 days and unfortunately found out that through the imaging that there was a mass in Savannah's brain. The news meant physical therapy, tests and some neurological damage, all adding up to big bills. So the community got to work. Kids, parents, teachers, friends, the whole the whole little town of Moyak just kind of it's really spending the time and the energy to break dollars down into coins. Moyak Elementary raised $5,000 from Penny Wars. My friends, um, they helped me through tough things. Soon, Jacqueline's friends reached out to help. Before Savannah went back to school, we went to have a haircut, and Tabitha is an amazing stylist, so the fact that she came forward, she really went and reached to a different level. The Hair to Die For Salon is giving free cuts on Tuesdays, all to raise money for Savannah. She's radiant. Um, you can't help but instantly fall in love with Savannah. Instead of payment, Tabitha just asks that you donate to Savannah's GoFundMe page. Tabitha hopes more people come in for a cut. <laughs> to trim down Savannah's health costs. If you can get a haircut and donate to a little girl who is in medical need, why not? We still have a long road to go recovery-wise and financially, um, but we'll get there one step or another. And today, Savannah's feeling pretty lucky. I thought I was somebody that was really lucky. If you're someone who is in the market for a haircut and want to help out, the salon is offering cuts tomorrow for free and accepting donations. This is going to be going on each Tuesday for the rest of October. Live in the studio, I'm Megan Perrier, 13 News Now.